I'm scared because I'm, cu I'm quite proud of myself for quitting coffee, to be honest. But I know for a fact, I know for a fact, if someone, you know, like, okay, hold on. You know, you know, D.A.R.E., you know, the D.A.R.E. program where they're like, if they're like, don't do drugs or whatever. I remember in the D.A.R.E. program in my school, they were like, they kept telling me, they were like, someday someone's going to walk up to you in your lifetime and they're going to ask you if you want a cigarette and you can say yes or you can say no. And if you say yes, you're going to be a smoker and die of lung cancer. And if you say no, you're a good kid. <laughs> That never actually happened to me, but I feel like if someone walked up to me in my life right now and was like, hey, yo, kid, you want some coffee? I would be like, <laughs> I wouldn't know what to do, to be honest. I don't know. What would I do? Do I say yes? I want coffee. Yes, obviously. But do I, do I say no and be a good kid? I don't know. <laughs> You're just like, someone walks up to me like, hey, yo, kid, you want some espresso? And I'm like, no! Get out of here with that devil juice. Gosh, it's been so long since I've been to D.A.R.E. I don't know what I should say. Do I say yes or no? It's, it's like you studied for a test and like, it's, and like you don't remember if the answer was yes or no for the test. So then someone comes up to you and they're like, Hey, you want a cigarette? And then you're like, oh crap. <laughs> I have to really think about what the answer is. Multiple choice. You're like, D, yes, all the above. Give me all the drugs. I'm actually scared to know what would happen if I drank coffee again. I feel like I would be bouncing off the walls. You'd see me jumping on that thing like a trampoline. You're going to get wired off the next coffee. Might want to start with a half shot. That's the thing is it's like, I know. It's like impending doom, right? Like, I know at some point, someday, I will drink coffee again. I'm just trying to be as strong as possible i'm trying to prove to myself i'm a strong independent woman and i don't need caffeine sometimes i feel like actually i need it right now because i'm a little tired but no decaf might suit you yeah but decaf decaf is a starter decaf will get me back into hardcore espresso shots again <laughs> you, you just have a little bit of decaf and then you're like oh, i need more caffeine and then you're just then you're just putting Red Bull in your espresso machine. And then it's all over from there. I've seen it happen to everyone. Start slowly. You guys don't understand. I have zero self-control. You're snorting instant powder in two days. Starts with decaf and ends with IV coffee. I'll be injecting coffee into my veins next week. Coffee, not even once.